we are following breaking news out of Spring Valley where a man was shot by a San Diego County Sheriff's deputy. Thanks for being here at 6 a.m. I'm Eric Connert. And I'm Nettie Irampour. This shooting happened last night in the 3600 block of South Barcelona Street, right next to the 94, as you see on the map right there. Authorities sharing new details overnight about what happened. CBS 8's Dana Marie McNichol live at the scene now. It has been hours. Dana Marie, what's the latest? Well, Eric and Ned, I could tell you that it is still an active scene, although we have seen multiple sheriff's um, deputies leave. I spoke to one about a half an hour ago saying that this area should be opened up with at least in a couple of hours, if not sooner. In terms of what happened, everything started 730 last night in the home right behind me. I'm going to step out of the way so you can see um, even some Looks like police deputies outside that cream home. Let's listen to what um, police told us happened, especially um, since that deputy was involved. Uh, deputies received a call here at the 3600 block of South Barcelona uh, about a uh, male threatening people with uh, some sort of uh, metal bar here uh, at, a, at a residence. Um, deputies responded when they got here. They uh, brought people out of the residence uh, and then attempted to contact this male. During that, uh, Mel was armed with a, a metal pipe, uh, sorry, a metal bar of some sort, and a uh, deputy discharged his service weapon as the male approached them. Um, Mel was struck at least at least once, uh, taken to a local hospital. He's uh, in stable condition, is my understanding at this point. And we do know, thankfully, that of course you heard their deputies got to the home. They were. They brought the people out of the residents that were not involved in this. Um, a deputy was not hurt. Police right now are in the middle of their investigation. San Diego Police Department is doing that for protocol and transparency. When anything happens in terms of uh, a deputy involved shooting, that's why San Diego Police investigates. Now they're going to be here all morning long. Like I said, again, we're right off the 94. Um, if we get any more information on the condition of that man right now, again, he is stable in the hospital. Of course, we'll bring that to you. CBS8.com has the latest information if you'd like to read more. I'm Dana Marie McNichol coming to you live for Spring Valley.